Okay. Um, hi, I'm Philip. I'm from the Solomon Islands. Hi, uh, yes, I'm Andrew from Solomon Islands. So. Mm. Um, we have been here for almost 10 months and studying medicine, but we just have completed the part of pre-med as a language and basically um, part of some of the subjects too. Mm. And yeah, in Cuba, it's it's nice, and there are some difficulties that we have to in Cuba, like in terms of yeah, like in, in terms of allowances or something like that. But it's not the fact that we have problem with our allowances because we have food in our in our school. Yeah. We have every necessity that they give us something like to use personal yeah. things, something like that. But there's few things about our like our for our personal needs, something like that. That's we have problem with. Mm. But nowadays we have. have like it'll be fine because like government give us this few amounts of money mm. or oh, not the real government but the Ministry of Health this yeah. few amounts of money just to help us yeah. so we're not with that um, what were you studying before before you got into this program uh, like at home uh, what what sort of studies had you done or what were you planning to do okay um, basically uh, most of us have been in foundation science which is under the University of the South Pacific program and some of the students which is in the in our group supposed to go to where the University of the South uh, University of Papua New Guinea mm. for medicine studies and some FSM which is Fiji School of Medicine mm. but then come this scholarship mm. and then we pre we prefer to come and study at Cuba mm. yeah that's basically before we came to Cuba mm. most of us has been doing uh, Form 7, which is Foundation Science at the University of South Pacific. Mm. Uh, Pre-university. Yeah, yeah pre-university. Yeah. And um, how many uh, Solomon Island students are there here now? Um, there are 50 of us right now. The, the first 25 has already graduated. That is from pre-med. And there are 25 that just arrived a month ago here. Mm that are still doing elementary, which is the first part of pre-med. Mm. Yeah. So and in total, there are 50 of us right now mm. in Cuba. And everyone in the first group passed the, the pre-medical course? Um, yeah. yeah. I think, um, to be honest, Solomon Islands have performed pretty uh, well here. Mm. And yeah, academically, and it's like we, we all of, almo almost all of us, yeah pass well with our studies with excellente and with B. Yeah. So it's good. And what would you, if you could send a message back home now, uh, you've been here for quite a while now, what, nine months or something? Uh, uh, what message would you like to send back home? Um, probably we would like to say, pass our regards to our family's home. Uh, the thing is that we can't we can't even communicate through telephone. Mm. We only communicate through emails, and yeah, I think it's a pleasure. And I would like to say on behalf of us, even though my friends and the others are not present with me, on behalf of us, we would like to say our greetings to our families mm. and regards. Yeah, bye, home. Yeah. Yeah. You know, to continue of that, I just want to say thanks for our government and the Cuban government too. But especially I want to thank the Ministry of Health that have pushed hard for us to be here in Cuba to study medicine, take this opportunity to study medicine in Cuba.